Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and uh, one big update to the fiasco of the local security authority problem in the Windows security app. Once again, it happened last month. I actually should have fixed that works. And um, if you go into the uh, device security on your Windows security app in core isolation in details, there's something called the local security authority protection. And of course, the big problem is that uh, most people are getting an error message, a little triangle, a yellow triangle on the app icon says that it's off. So um, first of all, if you go into your Windows security app in device security core isolation and go here, turn it on. If it's already on, there's a dismiss button at the error message. Simply click dismiss. For most people, that is enough, and it's going to come back to normal. It's going to be okay. Uh, once again, don't worry. It, it works. It's just that the reporting is wrong. For those that it doesn't work like that, I have a video that I made where I show you how to fix it by changing a few things in the registry. And if some of the registry keys are missing, you create them. Now, the um, that other option, the video, I will post the link again in the description below so that you can go to the video and see it. So you just follow the instructions. A lot of you have been mentioning that you don't see local security authority protection. It's not there. And the problem with this is that some of you have the error. So you'll have a yellow triangle. It's going to tell you that local security authority protection is off. But when you go and check, you don't see it in the options here. So a lot of people are mentioning that. And it is absolutely true that some people, I saw someone posting in a blog post that he had it. He reinstalled Windows. And since he reinstalled Windows, the security app doesn't show local security authority protection. But he's got the yellow triangle saying that there's a problem. So for those of you that are in that situation, follow the video that is in the description below with the registry keys and the values that I add. You'll see that after that is done, when you restart, it's going to be fine. So uh, that's the way to do it. It should be okay after restart. So Microsoft actually removed what they called the fix to this problem because it apparently didn't fix anything. And a lot of you actually in the next day told me, um, I got that update, but I don't. it's not fixed. And um, I tried on my own uh, unsupported hardware PC here, and definitely the only thing I did was click the dismiss button. It never went away. So that's the latest news on this, uh, what I'll call the uh, local security authority fiasco from Microsoft in the Windows security app. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching. And don't forget the link to the video for the instructions is in the description below.